Hey everybody, welcome back. Dan, no games, old men, Chaos Gate, Demon Hunters. Here we are. What is going on? Warp Storm, Death Guard Cruiser, Death Guard Cruiser, Reaper. <laughs> but we're gonna do this mission first. Seeding the Bloom. They're all called Seeding the Bloom. Anyway, so we've got Eliminate Seed Carriers. Win the mission without master crafted ranged weapons. That's doable. So we're going to select that. Yes, give us that one extra requisition so that when Grandmaster Kai stops being grumpy at us, we can get some stuff. Here's who we've got. Estrios as our Justicar. Nobody has a master crafted ranged weapon, as we can see here. We've got Cadulon as our apothecary. He was three experience points away from promotion last time. We're going to get him that promotion. Varn is in as an interceptor in place of Storm. I want to see if I can play around with uh, his his heavy weapon. That didn't come out right at all. Justinian Zabus as our other interceptor with the Grey Blade Force Sword. Let us... Vamanos. Drink your water, folks. I just got back from lunch with my wife, and uh, we had a couple of alcoholic beverages, so I might be a little looser right now than I normally am. I usually record in the mornings, so all I've <laughs> all I've had is water and coffee and Our oatmeal. Our target appears to be the heart of a hive world dockyard. Is it possible that our prognosticants were mistaken? Have some faith, Purifier. What better place is there than a busy transport hub to spread a mass infection? You may have a point, Inquisitor. She Brothers, may. seek for signs of the bloom and destroy any obstacle you find. All right. Oh, look. Look at that. Look, just so many, so many seed carriers. That guy's walking directly into that wall, so he's not going to get very far. Wow, four. Okay. I am very glad that we've got Estrios with the Extractor Skull then, because we're going to make some Zabers. use of that. Let's get it up to here. So we've got a, a kind of a corridor of movement that we can take. I wonder if I get him up to here, if that's going to kick off. With haste. Activity. Definitely. Oh! I thought he would talk about his reading. He did not. I guess we already know. No grenades. I haven't used a grenade in a very long time, so. I get really, really uh, pleased when I see those Valor deeds that tell you to not use a grenade. That is not difficult at this point. What am I missing out on, though? Oh, that guy made it through that wall. There must be a door over there. Okay. Your orders? Oh, let's see, Cadulon. Let's get you over to here? Or do we just bust you around the corner? No, because everybody done. gets their action points back once once everyone yeah once we see what we've I, uh, are facing. So let's get everyone what is your kind of bunched up a little bit on my way. And let's go Ready with Estros. You make the first creep out. Yes, let's see if this unlocks it. Oh, oh, oh. Oh my god! Okay, so that's the hell brute. What do we have here? Oh, he's he's geared up. Look at this thing. Holy expletive deleted. Okay, we don't want any part of whatever happened. Plasma, for sure, but look at this like mouthy maw. Like 
<laughs> All right, let's see what this thing can do. This is the first time we've ever faced one of these. This one has one mutation, so they're going easy on us. Crit defense, minus 25% crit vulnerability. Wow. Okay, that's something. 20 hit points, 10 stun, jeez. Oh, it's mechanical. I guess. It looked, it doesn't look mechanical. Most of it looks organic. That's interesting. Eight armor, ooh, five move, four pox of seeds. So let's go ahead and send out our extractor skull. All right, enraged rush. Gain auto enraged rush 100% once per turn. When hit, Hellbrute charges his attacker to grab them, throwing them the next turn. Okay, so if that happens, we'll have to see if we, we can figure out how to either kill him outright or get him to drop whoever he's grabbed. Power scourge grab, melee attack, grab target knight. They cannot act this turn. Next turn, deal four damage. Okay, so, so far these first two things have to have, are a two turn action. First he grabs, the next turn he does the bad thing. Bull Rush, okay, well, we know that because we've played Mutant Year Zero. Wow, my brain just shut the F down there for a second. Like I said, I had a couple of drinks at, at lunch. Plasma Cannon. Char oh, plasma Cannon Charge Shot. That's what he's doing right now. He's charging the Plasma Cannon. Set a Blast over Area 3, Range 14, deal 9 damage to Armor Break. Armor Break. That's not Armor Pierce. That's Armor Break. That bre permanently breaks armor for the rest of the mission. That's dangerous. Cover Shot. Target a Blast over Area 3. Okay, destroys cover. That we know. Passive Abilities. Immunity to Afflictions. Panicked. Plagued and knockback. I don't. The Grey Knights do not plague anybody. We do knockback though, with crushing charge and grenades. Panicked. I don't think I've ever seen anybody get. I don't think we've got. Do we have abilities that can panic? I don't know. Self destruct. Ooh, that's important. 100%. 100%. Once per turn. It's, you're self destructing. It's not going to happen twice. On death. Set a blast over area five. Next turn, deal six damage. Armor break one. All right, so that encourages us to take this guy out with ranged weapons. Armaments. The power scourge. Strike an adjacent target to deal five damage and knock back. Or the plasma cannon, which is charging now. Target a blast over area two, range ten, deal six damage, armor break one, and knock back. Hellbrute, look at this guy. I've got to screenshot this. I'm gonna make a stupid face because I've got I've got to do it for the uh, for the end card or for the uh, what do you call it? Thumbnail. All right, so here we go. It had to be done. It had to be done. I'm sorry. I know that looked dumb. All right, what are we gonna do? Ooh, okay. Ooh, we might be able to do. We've got two explosive things in his vicinity. This one's not going to do anything yet. This one might have the radius. I think it maybe not. But we got to get out of here. Is at your command the first? Yes, commander. That's the first thing we need to do. So what if we get Estros up to here now? And first thing we're going to extract. Grab these seeds. He's got four poxy seeds. I don't really... I've got a ton of poxy seeds. I don't feel like I use them very much. Because I've done all the upgrades I, I, I the can seat. with what I've got. But I've got a bunch of tier 3 gear that I can pick up. All of my gear, almost, is tier 2 or 1. I've got a ton of tier 1 stuff. So once we get into tier 3, that's going to be a lot more opportunities to... Uh, Upgrade. Okay, so this shot is going to blow this up and um, do three points of armor damage. Eh. Eh. So, eh, maybe not. I can do four points and a stun if I just shoot him outright. So, yeah, I'm thinking that's not real exciting. <sighs> Let's see. What we do need to remember, though, is that he explodes 
when we destroy him. So we want to make sure that we are not in the vicinity. So let's, let's teleport over here with one action. He did not get the charge. Does he not have that ability? Maybe he doesn't. I don't feel like that happens often for him. Reflexes, voter pressure, schmer, parry, auto ability, parry, teleport, boost. Oh, yeah. So he has it. Okay. Well, it just didn't happen this time. That's fine. Okay. He is here. He's within range. Does. He... Yes, Commander. No, he does not have support strike. Does he have support strike? Support fire. Yes, he does. Okay. So we're going to get both of these guys into range can he shoot from here no 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 i want I am him here, to serve. here we go he can Online. definitely shoot from there okay so what we're gonna do with him is we're gonna shoot this guy that's gonna trigger support fire from him and from from both of my interceptors that's what I'm trying to say. Alright, so here we go. This will be four armor damage. Psychic onslaught. We don't need to do that. Alright, here we go. Shoot. Nice. Support. Good. Armor is down. Oh! Great! Okay, do we do that again? I think we do. Down and oh! <laughs> oh, we got him! Oh, that was epic! He did not get a single shot off, but now we need to get yes, this guy the F out of here because this is gonna blow up, and that's gonna blow this up. And that might blow up, and it's just going to be a chain reaction of chaos and fun. We don't want any part of it. Oh, that was so cool! Look at this guy, though. Look at this guy. Can you imagine if you're playing if you're playing Warhammer 40k or kill would this be a kill team unit? I don't. This seems too big to be a kill team unit. Kill team is small, mobile units. This would definitely be a Warhammer 40,000 fieldable unit. This would be a lot of fun to paint. I think this guy. Oh. How fun. Looking good. Looking good. They did a great job with that character model. I almost feel bad for destroying it so quickly. It will be done. No, I don't. Not at all. <gasps> oh no! We got him too close to the next group. Oh, three plague marines and a hell. Ooh. Uh, what is that? A white hauler. Okay. The beasts. Uh, all right, so we've got a seed carrier here. Oh man, this guy's got a lot of armor. Ha! <sighs> so now I have to wait because this guy's gonna explode if I can't get people past him. Yeah. Uh, he's got three actions. Actually, I could get him past. What? What's the range on th this? All right, so I have. To, I couldn't put anybody behind this, which is a shame because that would have been where I would put someone. The the solution there is to shoot it preemptively. Then I could put somebody here. Maybe that's what maybe that's what I do. Ready to uh, did he does he have an action? My left? blade is yours. He does. Oh, he's got he's got three actions. So maybe we do that. Maybe we shoot this. Oh, he can't. Oh boy. Okay. All right. Never mind. Never mind. Come Let's get somebody else to do it. Yes, commander. Okay. Let's have him do it. You shoot this preemptively. Terrible. What a waste. 
And then the we'll get Varn. Uh, that just destroyed the thing. I was going to put Varn behind. So, mm, drag. Okay, how about this then? We can teleport Varn. And we can teleport Varn up to here. Oh dear. Uh, let's put Varn here. And then we can walk him up behind this. Run. Train car, because that is heavy cover, which we definitely want against this thing. Then, can we scatter shot? Oh, we can only hit the Plague Marine with the scatter shot, so let's just do a shooty shoot. Let's see, this will do three armor damage and a stun, which is important. Man, that's disappointing. Okay, let's see if we can get Unleash me. him involved. If we do a teleport strike. Really? Why can he not hit this guy with a teleport strike? Is it a is it a view? A line of sight thing? I feel like he's got line of sight. I can draw a straight line. From him to this, but maybe I don't know. Fidget games. All right, let's... Oh, boy, I need to deal with this, too. Okay, oh, one thing at a time. Get ahead of ourselves. All right. Teleport strike. Definitely can hit him here. Hit him here. And then... Oh, let's see. If we land here, then we can choose, then, who to hit after that. So let's go with that. Definitely warp charge. Let's get those extra two points of damage. Taste my fury. All right. Now, to if I get, got to remember these guys have standing ready, supporting fire, both of them. So if I get somebody into a position to be able to use that, so that's one, two. Okay, he's not going to be able to do it. Neither is he. All right. So both of these guys are out of supporting sh supporting fire range. Yeah. However, these guys can back each other up. So if I'm going to shoot... <sighs> Let's shoot the Blight Hauler, because this has... Uh, Varn's got the armor piercing. So we'll be able to take out the Blight Hauler immediately. Because it's only got two hit points left. Are you out of ammo? Zabus. Why did you not support fire? Why did you not support fire? I don't know. Well, we're just gonna hold the phone here. You're not gonna shoot, you're gonna sword. Beautiful. Is that the two of them? Yeah, they're done. Oh boy, okay, so this right here was well placed because that is keeping me from getting... I don't want to put him here. I know graphically it looks like that's the end of the explosion radius, but I feel like in the past I've had people outside of the explosion radius and they've still taken damage, so... I'm not comfortable moving him. So I think what we'll do instead is honor the chapter on... Estros. And then he will take two more swipes at this guy. Ooh, we got the critical hit. Outstanding. Okay, so for the last attack, we're gonna come up here to this guy, see if we can get a nice nice shot on him. Let's force strikes, we get that 75% chance to crit. Maybe we can chop his off, uh, weapon hand off. Excellent. Ooh, armor pierce. 
Can we kill him outright? I think that's that's what that's telling me. This is a critical hit. Armor Pierce. Dead. Another one down. That was great. Okay. Um, let's reload with him then. Because I don't want to move him. Because he'll just be too close to this Hellbrute's explosion. And I don't want to get Cadulon too close to this. Because really, this might set this off. So. Uh, let's see what the explosion radius is of that. Oh, I can't see because it was a shot. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's run him to here. As you will. And because he's got an action left, we'll shield him up. I think these guys are safe. Okay, good. to a, our first warp surge. Let's see. We've got some nasty ground here. He is... What is your will? Weird. Oh, that's corrupted right here. Wait, that is, but that isn't. Oh, no, this is because this is just on the edge of this Overwatch zone, so any action I take is going to cause problems. Okay, but this is, guy's a seed carrier, so we want to make sure that we get... Praise the Emperor. We want to make sure we claim that. Uh, let's bring Estros up the tracks and see if we've got range. We do not. All right, so we're going to move him up further. Skosh. Now, Varn. He's got Astral Aim. Oh no, that's Psychic Suppression. I thought he had Astral Aim. Guess not. I guess not. Okay, so what we'll do I then is me. we will teleport Zavis. Ooh, I think, yeah, this is safe. With an yeah, that's not within uh, this Overwatch zone, so I think we're safe to give him a wackadoo. Oh, sweet. Grab the seeds. Disable the ranged weapon. Here comes the... That'll let him Another claim the seeds. And one more swipe, and dead. Alright, that is two out of four. Seed carrier eliminated already. Need a little bit of water. You're going swimmingly. I want to. I don't want to be a little. I don't want to be. Uh, what is it? Arrogant, cocky about it. So we've got one more up here, one down here. We'll just continue down the tracks to the terminus there. With haste. All right, Ready knights, you are doing just beautifully. I don't see any seed pods around here. That is disappointing. Seed pods are such a wonderful source. Moving now. These bloom seeds. Okay, let's get them around this side of the train. You might notice I've also got Estros with the Warding Staff this time, rather than a Demon Hammer or something that you should equip me. on the Justicars. Just trying it out. Alright, Zabus. As you will. Uh, I think we'll be safe if we bring you up to here. Alright. 
Warp Surge. Ooh, those two are getting close to each other. We might have to deal with them simultaneously. Mm. Enemy forces gain a reinforcement. Okay, so with the seed carrier missions, we know once you eliminate the last seed carrier, you have to hold for extraction. You can't extract immediately like you can with the bloom spawn missions. So you wait three turns. At once. Yes, Commander. I'm here to command. Back to the last guy because you're only as fast as the last guy Taking in the team. Position. That was dramatic. That's your command. Astros, let's rush you up. And farm. Okay. All right. We've got some room. Room to groove. Moving swiftly. Oh, he's got one action left, but I don't want to get him too close. All right, let's get him to here. As you will. All right. They have walked through the door. Oh, yeah. These guys are approaching each other, so I really think we might have to deal with them simultaneously. There's a door, though. I could go through that. And if I can contain this group within this building, it could be beneficial. But, I gotta get in there first. I could bust through this window, but hey. It's Moving nice. now. Not necessary. Yes, sir. Cardinal. Whoa, you're so far back. We strive. Yes, Commander. Okay, I'm gonna bring him around the back through this other door. Wait, hold on. Is this a door? Is this it right here? That must be, because otherwise, how did they get through? Yes, here? sir. Okay, yeah, it is a door. Silver knights. Oh, we triggered them though, even though they're behind a solid. Okay, you're gonna bust through the window at me. Oop. Mutations. Fifty percent resistance. Hundred percent resistance. Oh gosh. Okay, so we can't afflict him with anything. I think you're clever. But I can These tell heretics will suffer I can the tell ultimate them. punishment. Facts. That's what I'm going to do now. Or unless I can teleport strike. I can go boop, boop. And I can end here and then come at this guy. How's that for an option? That is an option. Other hand, I could get him even closer. As ordered. And then do. Oh, that's weird. Oh, maybe he could see him through this window? Because now I can't target these guys. Well, that's a shame. Yeah. Okay, then we're gonna switch gears here. Praise the Emperor. What is your will? We're gonna bring... Okay, let's have him break the door. And get behind this oh, light cover way. with your last action. Okay. Doors open. Yes, Commander. Now we can get Estros up to here. It's not very far. Extractor skull. 
How many seeds does he have? Four. Holy smoke. Wow. Okay. Let's take them. Yes, please. This is coming with me. This is coming with me. Ready to Can we get Varn into a position to do a really nice... Scatter shot. At one. Get him up to here first. Uh, yeah, we can. Okay, so his last action, we will reload. This roof is really bothering me. So now, with Estros, we're going to honor the chapter. On Varn, At your command. Who is again going to scatter shot. Reload required. Okay. I'm here to serve. Now, Estros has one more action. Let's just shoot this guy, take care of him. Oh, I should have done Psychic Onslaught, because that would have uh, that would have shut up the, the other guy here. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh, let's see, Psychic Suppression. Range 10, Afflict Silence. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Cause this is a mouthy, mouthy boy. Oh right, because he just uh, everything. Because he just got 100% resistance. See you guys, you gotta pay attention to everything. Okay, let's do a teleport strike. We can do him for some reason now, even though we couldn't before. And we can do him, and then we'll land here and get an extra shot. Let's definitely warp charge it, get two extra points of damage. Sweet. And we'll do a nice big, nice big hit on him. Feel my rock. One more. Dead. Another one down. You must vomit on everybody. You cannot harm me. We only got one. How interesting. Okay. Well. Praise the Emperor. Do let's see, we need to reload with him because he's empty. So first action. Armed and ready. How about Estros? We run him down there to slap this guy. Or do we shoot him from here? Nope. We gotta We're gonna melee him. If I force strike, that'll guarantee the kill, so let's do it. I've only got one more sea carrier left, so I can be a little more liberal with my use of real power. Dang! Darth Malden, look at that. Just severed at the waist. Okay. Oh, a seed! <gasps> Ooh, somebody go back and get it. Yes, come on. Cadulon. Get, get over there. Get over there and get that. It will be done. Seed pot. Oh, you went through the window. Okay. Alright, that's a champion and a champion, two marines, and a plague bearer. Who just mutated. Okay, that's our seed carrier. Enemy sighted! 
Well. Yes, Commander. I was kind of hoping I would have had a little more time. Okay, if I teleport, how far can I get him? Get him to here, but that's danger. All right, first order then. At your command. Extractor skull. Actually, this needs to be last order of business because this is our last seed carrier. And I don't want to kick off the extraction until for the yeah. My blade is yours. I don't mean extraction as in seed extraction. I mean extraction as in from the battlefield. So what if I bring? Wait, one, two? You can only take two moves? I guess jumping through this takes up action. Oh, there we go. Never mind. It will be done. Never mind. All right, teleport strike. Who can I hit? I can hit this guy and that guy all by himself. So what if we go boom? Maybe that's what we do. We go teleport strike, hit him, land next to him. And then we hit him again. Hopefully we get a critical hit. Oh, look at that. Look at you replenishing your... Okay, force strike. What? No, 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 no. That's not what we want. Not what we want. We want Your orders? Cagillon. Ooh. Okay, now can't go through the window because he's bracing it. Bracing it. I am here to serve. That's not the right word at all. Let's have you teleport to I wonder if I can get no, because it's the angle is bad. If I scatter shot to him. Not gonna work. I could just blast this guy though. If I come around this corner. Like to there. Moving now. And then well let's just see. Let's just see what happens. Yeah, we definitely don't have the range, so we're just gonna blast this guy. That worked out real well. Um, Zabans. Yeah. Give me, yeah, you, you now come over here. Out. And let's do that same trick. We could take this guy out. Or we could shoot him. No, this guy. Shoot him, and that'll trigger support fire again. Dead. Lovely I use. Am the Empress vengeance. Now you, my friend, can you come around to here? And you're gonna surprise these dudes from the door. All right, you've got two more actions. You have no willpower. If I shoot this, will that... Oh my gosh, that will. Yeah, but it's not gonna, there's no point. No point. All right, come on, get a critical hit. No, you're not shooting, you're not shooting. You're right in his face, just stab him. Go for straight. Oh, I can't because I've got no willpower. Come on, get him. Critical hit. Hey, we've got seeds. Okay, great. Alright, there's one rift. There's going to be three rifts. One right in the room with us. And one outside. Okay. Doable. Oh, there's going to be four? Oh, there's going to be four. Oh, you guys. Okay. This is coming with me. Okay, we can do this. Win the rain. Win the mid. Okay. Okay. I'm 
now, if I shoot him... Or do I just shield him up? I think maybe that's what we do. Or do I reload? Yeah, I'll shield him up. Because these two guys are going to total... Ooh, you know what? I can teleport him out of there. No, because we've got all kinds of stuff happening here. Shield up. That's our champion. Definitely gonna teleport him out of there next time. I sense the enemy converging. Oh boy, okay. Light Lord Terminator and a Marine. And another Light Lord Terminator and another Marine. Oh gosh. Three plague bearers. Okay, and oh gosh, plague bringer and a plague bearer, and then there's also going to be a warp surge. That's going to do what? Give everybody five ammo, armor. All enemy melee attacks afflict immobilized for a turn. Fu Not cool. All right, what are you afflicted with? Vulnerable. Let's purify that. You're also damaged, so, uh, medic. Medic. Yo, come on. Get in here. Uh, okay, if I get in here and do some stabby stabby. Actually, no. Let's get here. Oh, can he see these guys? If I get in here, he can. All right, who do we need to get first? I want to get the champion. I don't like the champion. Not a fan. So if I put him here, or here, he can shoot at this guy. And if I get him into a position to do supporting fire, I think we can take out the champion pretty quickly. On my way. So here's, here's what we're doing. Servo Skull to heal, at least. Hopefully it'll cure him. Okay, he's no longer vulnerable. Great. My wrath is restored. Then standing ready. Zabus, you're going Oh, you don't have enough to teleport strike. Okay, so you're just gonna run up here. Do you have ammo? You got one ammo. Let's do this. Let's run him up to here and get a good swipe in here. Face me! Okay. Ready to serve. No. What is your apothecary. will? Apothecary. Okay, now, Apothecary, you are gonna shoot. Disciple. Get an extra point of damage in there and afflict bleed. Yes. You got the willpower to spare. Okay, good. Right, he's out of ammo, so if I just get a swipe in here, is he out of actions? He is. Okay. <sighs> okay, let's just let's do it. Four strike. Seventy-five percent chance. Get him! Oh, we got him! Another falls to the Knights of Titan. Oh, we got him! That was glorious. Okay, these two, we need to get you guys out of here because we've got two Blight Lord Terminators in the area. And those are going to do some bad news. Can we shoot this first? Why not? Why not? Why not? What's the problem? What's the problem? There we go. Now, why didn't that work on... Oh, wow. Oh, that's armor 
armor piercing too. Boom. Okay. Yes, come on. Him with his armor piercing attack. <sighs> oh my gosh, do I get do I put him right here? Like right in front of this guy and just do a I don't think I've got the range. So the range is I might have the range actually if I put him right next to the guy. Like right there. Just get right in his face. Moving swiftly. Oh gosh. Oh yeah, I can get them both. Wait a minute. He had armor piercing. Is it? Hey. Wait a minute. He did an armor piercing attack before. Oh, fudge. Okay, well, that's I'm here to serve. All right, here's what we need to do then. We need to reload. And then we're going to shoot at this guy. That's going to trigger the support fire. Down to three. Good. That's the end of his actions. Now, with the rest of your move, you're gonna do this. I sir. Okay, not bad. We got what one Blight Lord Terminator before he can take an action. His Aegis Shield just triggered, which is great because I got a whole bunch of melee attacks coming out of me. Uh oh. 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 Uh Slap. Immobilized. Yep. That's it. That's the, uh... That's because of the warp surge. Okay, now, I think I can eliminate that, though, with the servo skull, the Medicaid skull. We're gonna have to heal him, for sure. He's hiding. Probably gonna. Okay, this I'm concerned about because he might take out Estros. Okay, That's, that was a big hit, but not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Oh, he's got a plague. Jeez. Wow, all of that went to Estros. Every attack. Except this guy. Yep. Yep. All right. Wow, that was a lot. Oh, that was a lot. Okay, let's do. Unleash me. First thing, let's get him healed up. Oh, we're out of range. All right. Yes, Commander. Save us. Don't have enough for you to teleport strike. What if I get over here? Feel the bite of my sword. Justice. Mm. That did not do what I had hoped it would do. Ah! Okay. Taste my fury. Now if I get him over here. Then we can do this. What? Oh man, he's just barely out of range. Praise the Emperor. Shoot. 
shoot. I can't move him because he's hobbled. I can just start beating on these guys. Okay. Yeah. Him. Does he have the teleport swap? Doesn't. So what I would love to do is, oh, well, he's out of ammo. So first thing I have sanctified my round. What I would love to do is this, but that's going to hit him too. But look at that. That would be a nice chunky hit on all those guys. <sighs> what if we do this? What if we use him to get? Attacks on everybody. Vengeance. Oh, he blocked. Damn. Okay, disable melee weapon, get an extra stun. Raised. If I do that, he might go for somebody else. Let's do that. Let's have a little fun. Let's see if that does anything. Alright, we can attack one of these other guys. Let's see. I wonder if we... Casual. We really need to heal him. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. I am here to serve. Alright, we are going to honor the chapter here. Your orders? him to get over here to... Oh, shucks. I keep doing that. Well, I don't have any stratagems. Yeah. Yes, Commander. Okay, I know if I shoot him... The distance and the fact that he's in cover means he won't do any damage. However, it will trigger a supporting attack from this guy. So it'll still do some damage. Fire now! So yes, that was a miss, but then that happened. So it's the only reason I did that. Uh, okay, now does second suppression take an action? Yes, it does. So I could just shush. No, I can't because I'm out of range. All right. Okay. 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 Oh boy, this is, uh, this is tough. This is tough. Am I Get close enough? The enemy. Nope. I was thinking I'd be close enough to him, but now nah, he's just out of range. Okay, so if we shoot him again, we'll get the kill. That's at least one less shot that's gonna... Back, Okay, he just got his Aegis Shield triggered, so that's good news. Oh, we 
I've just got to keep. No, it's gonna take a hit. Oh, really? That hit drained all of that armor that he had. Oh no! Come on. Oh, dropped. Damn. Come on, hit, hit your buddy. Oh, come on. Why did you have to move for that? Oh, man. Taking hits. Oh, big dude coming in. Uh-oh. No. What in the world? Teleport coordinates locked. Initiating sequence. Oh, if only we had been able to keep Estros up. That one last turn. I mean, he's still alive, but he's got a critical injury now. So he's going to be in the infirmary for a long time. But we got the victory, that's the important thing. Well, okay, so I made a couple of tactical mistakes there, but I think mostly that went pretty well. Those first two encounters were really good. All right, so we got seven and 11 seeds, one requisition, oh. Is Kai not mad at us anymore? We've got some tier 3 stuff available for us now. Uh, okay. Unguents of Warding. 25% resistance. We've got Terminator Armor. Tier 2. I've got some tier 2 Terminator Armor already, so I think I'm going to hold out for tier 3 on that. This is interesting, though. Tier 3... Halberd. Five damage. Four strike does an additional damage. Demon Slayer does plus one against demonic targets, but can be upgraded to do four against demonic targets. That would be amazing. And that's just regular damage. That's not, you just even have to crit to get that. You just do that much extra damage to demonic targets. And Bane. Plus 20% crit chance against demonic targets. Upgradable to 40%. Oh, I'm gonna go ahead and grab that. And I don't have a tier 3, or if I do, I don't remember. Stormbolter. So 4 damage, 10 range. 25% chance to crit with Cybolt. Upgradable to 50%. The range is upgradable to 12 and upgradable to 15% extra crit chance. So I think we'll take that as well, but that's it. We're gonna, we're gonna leave this rank six apothecary. We've got apothecaries. We've got some real good apothecaries, except we didn't use him very well at that last turn. All I had to do, my apothecary was in that position to get uh, he would have, had I moved him closer to Estros, he would have taken a melee attack from that that guy, that um, space marine, or the plague marine, but I, I would have saved him, though, if I'd been able to get over there, to get one movement zone over, send the Medicaid skull, uh, heal him up, that would have saved him, and... Uh, that was just that was just bad management on my part. So that wasn't his fault, that was mine. Alright. He didn't earn enough XP to level up anyway. That's a bummer. Alright, Cadulon though. Promoted. Alright, Apothecary and Skull. Knight's Biomancies target any range. He doesn't have any Biomancies. 
I can upgrade his heal ability. Why don't we do that and then upgrade to Warp Speed Biomancer? He's got 11 willpower. That's quite a bit. Let's go with that. And then Zavis. Now a rank 7 Interceptor. Well done, sir. Alright, we've got the entire left side of the board here filled, and we were going for the Hammerhand Discipline. So let's give him Hammerhand. Hammerhand will do an extra crit damage, or afflicts Bleed. Um, let's go with... I feel like when I get into a position to do melee attacks, I mostly get the kills, but the times that I don't, it's just a few hit points, and so inflicting bleed might finish off the target. So let's go with that. Okay. Oh, not bad. Let's see what else we've got. What's going on here? Mac Manufactorum... What was I supposed to get out of that? I thought I was supposed to get servitors. Maybe not. Obviously not, because I don't have a bunch of servitors to use. Oh, wow. There's another Apothecarian upgrade that'll inc further increase wound recovery by 15%. 50? 50. That's 5-0. I can read... All right, here is our timeline. Iolanthus will be back in a day at full strength. Bloom suppression complete in two days. Estros will be out of the critical unit in nine. And then 11 days, a whole bunch of stuff's happening. These three guys who got thrown on a mission, I don't even remember what that was for. I don't even remember. I think it had something to do with Inquisitor Vakir. Somebody was going to give her a grimoire to be able to continue her research. That's what it was. That's why the other three Reaper researches are all um, forbidden knowledge. Because she needed that extra grimoire. To get it, those four guys had to go on that special mission. Okay. Okay. I think, I'm pretty sure that's what it was. Pretty sure. So, our next opportunities here, we could come down here, take care of this mission. There's a grimoire we could use. We could certainly use a grimoire. We could come all the way over here. No, we cannot. That would not... We could not make it to there. We couldn't make it to there. We can't make it to either of these extra missions. So, what we're going to do is just hang out where we are now. This is... It's this, y'all, right here. Munificus the Undying. Reaper of the Tenter Strain has been found. It's said that Nurgle granted him the gift of eternal growth. Let us put that legend to the test. Bunch of Tenter Seeds, looks like, available here. What is this thing? Is that just him? Or is this something else? Okay, yeah. Oh, this creature is constantly evolving and seems to be capable of healing at an astonishing rate. Oh, wow, that's interesting. Okay, so he's going to be constantly regenerating health. Oh, drag. It looks like that's our next opportunity, y'all. That's where we're going. We're going to have to enter uh we're going to have to take out this You know, what? let's just do it. No reason to be talking about it. Let's just do it. Head that direction. We have to encounter before we go through the warp storm, which is going to damage our ship anyway. We might get damaged encountering this Death Guard cruiser, but we have an opportunity to eliminate it anyway. Oh, before we even get there, Bloom Suppression 3 unlocked. 
I unearthed the records of one Severa Kaltuz, a Medicae who was instrumental on the shrine world of piety before the warp swallowed it whole. Through the work, though the work is centuries old, I have adapted her groundbreaking research into psychic quarantine. By predicting the strongest outbreaks, it should allow your prognosticars to insulate even heavily corrupted planets from eruptions from the warp. Sweet. Minus 15% warp surge per turn. That will be exceptionally useful. Let's get her on another project. While we have the opportunity. Surge prevention. All of these are stratagems. The only things that are not stratagems are finding the locations of the other Reapers. Which are locked right now. So, what stratagems would be most useful to me? Okay, let's just start on this one. Because we'll need that to unlock these other deeper tiers. So, let's just do that. Still don't have enough servitors to have a construction project going. So we're going to continue along this flight. Death Guard encountered. All right. Ooh, look how... Look at the oh, yeah. pustules on that ship. Detected. It is closing in fast, Commander. Warning. Corrupting pustules located on the ship's surface. Close quarters combat presents extreme risk. Commander, then let's shoot it. strike force to attack the ship from within. No! What? Close quarters combat it presents extreme risk. She just said that. Alright, send a strike squad. Four knights will be at risk. Open fire at a distance. The ship may be at risk. Use the Inquisitor's, Inquisitor's help. Requires bloom excision. Okay, well, we don't have that. Retreat? No! No! We came in here with a mission, so we're gonna fire. Open fire. Let's see if we can take it out. We've got... It's got level 2 gun batteries. Ours are level 3 plus level 3 void shields. I think we're gonna win this fight, but how much damage do we take? That's the question. Opening fire. Boom. The enemy cruiser manages to reach the edict. Oh, shucks. Corroding your hull and contaminating the servitor stock. No. Before you manage to defeat it. Minus one hull integrity, minus one servitor. Okay, yeah, it's not so bad. Cruiser destroyed, plus two requisition. All right, hull integrity then is down to four. So we could then get into here to the Manufactorum and start a repair project, right? We can't, we don't have enough servitors. But that's an opportunity, though. If you've got the servitors, you can just activate the mechanical bay, and that'll repair your hull integrity. But I think we're okay. We're all right, everybody. We're all right. And that Death Guard cruiser is Nomos. But here we go. This is going to be our next mission. Okay, I don't even want to click on it yet. I don't even want to click on it yet. Oh, next time. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for joining me on this adventure. Uh, do the things. Uh, like and subscribe. Leave a comment if you've got some some tips for me on the next boss battle that is about to come. I am going in this completely blind. I'm not watching anybody else's um, Let's Plays if they're ahead of me. I'll watch the stuff that I've already done just to see what I could have done differently. But if they're ahead of me and the story, I don't watch. I, I, I wait. Uh, so, uh, if you've got tips for me, though, eh, you know, that could be helpful. <sighs> Alright, thanks again. See you next time. Thanks for watching.